Welcome back. So I received another download, guys, and it came to me. It was like, you got folks out there that are mad that you don't hate them. They're mad that you don't hate them. And that is also the beauty of finding something that is positive about the experience or interactions that you went through. Even if I know it could have been very hard. It can be very hard in some, a lot of situations where you're like, okay. But... Finding the good and the not so good, it benefits you. It benefits how you feel about yourself and going forward. A lot of these people, they were able to siphon your energy. And when I think about that siphon, what came to me was someone trying to steal gas and Sucking it out. Um, Because again, you got the juice. You got the juice. So, you know, a way for people to take some of that energy is by getting you ticked off. By getting you in your head space. By getting you so angry that you would do something that you would regret. And you still move with love. A lot of these people was loved ones. And at the end of the day, you still got love for, for them, but from afar. And a lot of these people wanted you to hate them so that they can feed off of some type of your energy. They wasn't getting to interact with your energy anymore the way they thought that they could. They saw you waking up. They saw you in certain instances standing on your power. They may have tried to use insults and, you know, you to feel guilty and make you feel small, unimportant. Just so that they can feed off your energy. And guess what? You still move with love. And it's something when you move through love. And sometimes for a lot of these folks, they feel as if love. You know how to be cold as well. They may feel cold. Now that you've walked away, now that you've removed yourself from the situation, a lot of y'all, y'all moved away from them with love. That was for love from them. Because the longer you stayed around these folks, and they were wishing ill intentions for you, that was the more karma that they was racking up on themselves. Some of y'all was like, man, they going to get towed up, man. I just, I'm going to go ahead and walk away from them. That's enough. I might as well like 
well, their intentions have been ill since the beginning. Oh, I might as well just remove myself. I already know. The most high don't play about me. The most high don't play about me. Is that what y'all was telling them? That's what y'all was thinking. Some of y'all had to tell these folks. Might have said it just slid, slid it right on in when they was crossing you and thought that they was getting away with something. The most high don't play about me. Said it real smooth. Smooth. Y'all smooth out there. A lot of y'all didn't do no talking. Y'all just let it play out. Yeah, you got folks hey, they, they, they so salty. They hate it. They hate that you don't hate them. They hate that you weren't competing with them. They hate that you don't care what they got. So, it's, I just had to come on here real quick to say that. They hate that you move with love. Love is patient. Love is kind. That's true. Love will allow you to protect yourself. Love will allow you to move through life where you're focusing on the things that matter. The things that matter within. The people that matter. A lot of you guys were sent out here on a mission. You know that there's people, situations, experiences that will not only change your life, but the lives of other people. You ain't got time. To be surrounding yourself with hateful people. So they mad at you. Because through it all, you still move with love. You still love on family members. Even though you seen, maybe seen, experienced some most horrendic, horrendic. If that's even how you pr pronounce that word. Horrific. It's just, you still love them. You still got love for her. Because I believe that if you once love someone, the love is still there somewhere. But the hate will cause illnesses within your own self. You're going to tear yourself up by hating these people. No. They hate that. They hate that you won't spend your time on earth walking around with hatred in your heart. They mad. Not only did they want to control the outside of you, what you had going on, how you thought about yourself, but then they want to control the inside of you as well. Your mind. Your heart, your spirit. Forget the man, forget about what these people are talking about. Let them walk around with that hatred. And through it all, some of y'all ain't never wanted wish ill intentions on these folks.
Some of y'all do know that y'all return the sender though. Return that negative energy back to the person that sent it to me. And, so, and some of y'all angels said, yeah, times 10 for the trouble, for even thinking that they can do that to y'all. So, yeah, y'all got folks out there, they, they hate you. They hate you that you move through with, through life with love. They hate it. Let them keep hating, y'all. Let them keep hating. Let them keep hating. Let them keep hating. And I mean that. Take care.